community scroll down to pet of the day. Guys. All right, looking forward to that. In the meantime, we play musical chairs around here. Yeah. I need lines. to get up and stretch my legs. You need to walk around a little bit. We have to do that every now and then. It's a long show. It's a long show. Yeah. Four and a half hours. You know. <laughs> Gotta get up and walk around. Uh, busy morning yesterday. How's it looking out there Very today? busy yesterday. We had a couple of overturned vehicles yesterday. Nothing like that so far today. It's just construction out there. As we may take a live look outside, traffic cam, 95, and the Acosta, not a bad ride there at all. We're going to give that one a green light in both directions as you make your way around downtown this morning. Some construction still going on on the south end, right around Phillips Highway going northbound. And also, they're still picking up those cones northbound right at JTB. Should be out of your way in the next few minutes, but if you're leaving uh, in the next 10 minutes or so, watch out for some minor delays there. Coming in for the beaches, Things are looking pretty good on Atlantic Beach, Butler Boulevard. Let's take a look at that travel speed on Butler, or on Beach, actually. 15 minutes from 1st Street down to Southside Boulevard, so no major delays there. And swinging down into the St. Augustine area, not a bad ride on US-1 or State Road 16. There's your real-time traffic speed on 16 as you make your way toward I-95, 48 miles per hour, not bad. Gas prices in St. Augustine or in the St. Augustine area, 344 US-1 and State Road 206. Check out the lowest gas prices in your area. Go to actionnewsjax.com, click on Featured Content, and there you see it, Jacksonville gas prices. That's your update from the Safe Test Security First Alert Traffic Center. Donna Mike. All right, thank you, Derek. Well, every week we show